Uh, the FIU football team is mourning the loss of a player. He died last night. He's only 22 years old. Local 10 News reporter Ian Margul is live in Southwest Miami-Dade with how the player is being remembered by his team. Such sad news here, Ian. Oh, it's just absolutely heartbreaking. What we can tell you is there is no foul play suspected in this case. We know there are players and people so sad and mourning today from here at FIU and all across the country. A Florida International University football player dying unexpectedly Wednesday. 22-year-old linebacker Luke Knox had just transferred to FIU from Ole Miss. His brother, Dawson, is a tight end for the Buffalo Bills, and Bills head coach Sean McDermott addressed the media Thursday morning. My heart goes out to, our hearts go out to Dawson and his family. Uh, during this time on Twitter, FIU Athletics sent out this statement saying they're saddened by the sudden passing of Luke Knox and that they send their thoughts and prayers to his family, friends and teammates. FIU head coach Mike McIntyre actually coached Knox at Ole Miss as well. And in his statement said in part, quote, while I admire his passion for football, his genuine love for his family and teammates is what I will always remember. He had a special way of making everyone around him feel comfortable and confident. Luke's family is special to me and they will continually be in my heart and in my prayers during this difficult time. Similarly, Ole Miss head coach Lane Kiffin put out a statement saying he was grateful for his personal relationship and time spent with Knox. He called him a tremendous teammate and even better person who lifted up everyone around him. So we do know FIU police responded to the university tower dorms yesterday for this. He was then brought to the hospital where he later passed away. Miami-Dade police are now investigating this as a death investigation. As soon as we learn more, we'll let you know. Live at FIU, I'm Ian Margul, Local 10 News. Oh, such a mystery there. Okay, 